What's up guys, this is Matt aka Lloyd Milligan and I'm bringing you another uh, Lines of Sight video. This time we're on Villa and as always, uh, these spots are ones that hopefully you guys don't know about. Uh, I learned them from uh, going to the event, the MLG event and from watching pros play and from watching uh, some of my good buddies play. So, um, oh and thanks again to uh, my boy Reckless, he helped me find a few of these and uh, so here we go alright the first one is you saw there was a bit of difficulty but if you climb up on that rail right there and jump on this barrel uh, you can see the top balcony you can see it right there above that wall when I jump but if someone's shooting off that balcony they're likely to be out in the front and you can spot them uh, you kinda of far to get a kill but that was one spot I saw someone check uh, up here search and destroy it's all about kinda of spotting the uh, offensive guys as they're coming and uh, this is one of the spots that a lot of people use if you jump up here or just anywhere up here you can kinda of see people uh, coming down and um, one good thing about the map design in this game is almost every spot has a counter spot so I'm gonna show you a few on this map few spots and counter spots that I found this is uh, one of them and uh, let's go down here I'll show you the counter spot right now so on offense if you come up to this rock uh, you can peek right through this little hole right here and you can head clip it real nice this rock real nice and you can watch that little gap right there so if someone's coming to check this area they're likely to go there and again you might not get the kill but you're gonna get a nice clean view of them without them really knowing um, I wanted to point out this building in search is really important most of the pro teams will put a player up here and uh, a lot of people don't realize this but you can you get a nice easy shot right to connector from here so uh, and again you can you can get a nice head clip so uh, that is a pretty good spot and uh, obviously you, you can view uh, C Street also so that this area is re really important oh and you can spot people on balcony some teams will send someone up here or you can spot people going down these stairs over here alright now back to the fountain um, this this fountain it's really hard to see people um, through this water and uh, the other day I got killed from a spot I'd never seen anyone use before and uh, also Reckless pointed this out to me um, if you are especially if you're close to the middle they will not be able to see you on the other side so you can just watch that spawn or watch this uh, sea dom area and it's pretty nice oh uh, this is a, a way to check connector you're coming up here and you don't want to go this way because he's probably going to be checking this way you can uh, run right up here and peek right through this little crack right here and uh, you can shoot through it too uh, there's a barrier here on the top I guess but uh, as long as you shoot a little high it goes right through so that's a pretty good spot um, one spot that a lot of people use on this map all game types is up on these these little uh, barriers and you can check uh, people coming into connector but uh, something I don't see people do a lot is oh you can also uh, if you want to you can also jump on the bomb and uh, do it that way but uh, one thing I don't see people do a lot is you can actually jump on this fountain and get behind here and you're pretty much invisible and you have a shot all the way at that guy on the back side who's uh, guarding that that's where I was standing before right there so uh, that is an area you might want to check uh, let's see what else uh, I think most people know about this by now but there's a window right there and if you come in here and jump on the bar you can get a nice view of the bomb. You can even stun it and nade it. <clears throat> so that's a good spot. 
uh, oh yeah, I was showing you before that um, people like to sit in this window, or in that building rather. Well, you can head clip this, a lot of people do that, and you can obviously head clip it to top bar also. But one thing I saw the pros do that I didn't realize, uh, this barrel, these barrels are the perfect height to stand next to, but if you crouch you can't see through them. But if you look right in this corner here, you'll have a nice, nice shot at a top C building. So that's a pretty nice little spot. And then the other sort of counter to that is uh, if you lay here, that's that barrel I was sitting behind. And if someone tries to head clip it, you can burst and get the kill. I think that is about it. Um, I did see someone, this is not super technical or anything, but I saw someone sitting up here rather than sitting here where you're, you know, they have a shot at most of your body. This is sort of a little surprise spot. They're not going to be looking. And I think that is about all I have to show you guys. Uh, oh, this, yeah, this was another spot to cover bottom bar. And I think that is about it, guys. Um, that wraps the S and D maps, I think. Um, I'm willing to do this, uh, show you some lines of sight in all the maps if you guys are interested. Let me know in the comments. Um, I can start working through the non-MLG maps. Um, it's just about sort of trying stuff out and seeing what seeing what uh, what you can see, climbing on stuff. And uh, that is about it, guys. Uh, so let me, like I said, let me know what you think, and I will talk to you guys soon. Later.